Hello. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. Hello. Good morning. Hello. Hello. And welcome to our hundredth video. Fantastic. Can't believe it, can you? A hundred videos. Brilliant. Absolutely superb. And that is down to all of you lot. Thank you so much for encouraging us and supporting us and helping us to get this channel up and running. Um, we didn't think that we'd ever get to the amount of subscribers that we have now, but it's just absolutely phenomenal. I've not really started doing our travels properly yet. Yeah, just the beginnings. Just the beginnings. But yeah, it's so much work kind of goes into actually making these vlogs that... Uh, we wouldn't have made so many without you, so no. really, really appreciate that. And it's lovely, all the comments that you write, it just really inspires us and keeps us going and it's it's absolutely wonderful. And I just feel like I know so many of you now. It's brilliant. So a big, big thank you to all of you for watching. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, back in 2018, this is what we were filming our vlogs on, this tiny little GoPro session. We've kind of come a long way equipment-wise uh, since then. But what I thought I'd do is actually kind of just ask you what was your favourite video from 2018, 19, 20? So let's, let's start with 2018. 2018. What was your okay. favourite video? Um, well, I think, now this is going to be a European video because obviously Andy works full time. We, our holidays that we get, we tend to go to Europe rather than travelling in the UK. Our UK videos that come out are really are just our long weekends that we make. So our big holidays. Are in Europe so I think it's gonna to have to be a European one and it would be the Zermatt Zermatt, Zermatt Matterhorn fantastic it's just a beautiful place anyway and to have actually walked up the Matterhorn was just sublime and we went up on the cable car um, to the top saw Mont Blanc, Chamonix, a beautiful blue skies it was absolutely fantastic really good so that's probably one of my best yeah stories. it's an absolute dream there yeah, wasn't it beautiful the, uh, the Matterhorn if you've never seen it in real life it just kind of blows you away and it's crazy because all the cars but there isn't any cars they're all electronic aren't they absolutely amazing what is yours well, uh, mine is also a European one, and it's also from Switzerland, like Zermatt, but mine from 2018 is uh, Lotterbrunnen. Fantastic valley. It's so deep and so long and waterfalls down the side of it. Actually, actually kind of really picturesque, isn't it? That's uh, beautiful. And, and not only kind of was, was the valley great, our actual kind of leaving in that particular vlog to go to Zermatt uh, oh, involves a bit of a surprise because we're just driving along uh, and we get to a kind of queue of traffic and we think, oh, maybe it's a bit of a toll road, waited and waited. <laughs> And the next thing we wave forward and we kind of shunted onto uh, what can only be described as uh, a train with no sides on it. And so there's Katie kind of going through tunnel, through the tunnel with uh, no sides on. And it was crazy. We had no idea where we were going. There was no lights in there either. And it was really long, wasn't it? I don't know how many miles it was. It will say on the video if you ever watch it. Um, and it was just crazy. And actually, Katie, we scrawled the wing mirrors, didn't we? Because we're quite it's wide. So narrow. Oh, how we drove along there and actually just to get on it and then to get back off it again. So 2019, what's your favourite video? 2019. Well, we were in Europe again. It's going to have to be. Um, and we were in Spain. So I would say it would have to be the Tour de Did you even know places like this existed? because we were blown away. It was just phenomenal. Every step we took, we were just like yeah. mouths wide open.
and we walked up through the forest. It was a really hard climb, wasn't it? It yeah. doesn't have to necessarily be that way because the way we walk back, you can actually walk that way up and then return that same way. But we did it quite hardcore, didn't we? And at the end, there was this amazing waterfall, absolutely just stunning, so powerful, yeah. beautiful, really tall, gorgeous. And then we just followed the valley all the way back down again. It was sublime. Yeah. One of my favourite, favourite moments. Beautiful. It's like a video in somebody walking into a an oil painting. You know, it just that's yeah. why we named the, the title of the video that way because you just can't believe it's real when you watch it. You would think I've colour graded it, but I haven't. It's just literally naturally naturally those colours. So And I think all credit goes to you. Because the music from start to finish, the music, the timing, it's just beautiful. It is like a little movie, so it's definitely mm. one worth watching. Yeah. And if you're ever in Spain, you must go to Tula Odusa. Yeah. It's beautiful. <gasps> so, 2020? No, 2019. No. 2019? No, that was 2019. No. Yours? Yes, mine. <laughs> You've got to ask me now. <laughs> what was your favourite 2019? <laughs> oh, thank you for asking. <laughs> So mine was actually, again, from the same holiday. So I basically kind of started off by pretending to be a spaceman and uh, inside the capsule, walking out and then seeing the kind of the fantastic views. This is Motorboat Adventures Vlog, 7,852 feet. So fly levels are good. It is time to venture outside. Roger roll, Discovery. Fantastic wild stallion horse kind of performing That's, for us. Yeah, magnificent horse. Yeah, just walks across the camera. Yeah, mm. it just perfectly timed. Yeah. Amazing. And then kind of the, the cows on the way down. Going down to the valley, all yeah. The horns and things. Beautiful, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah, all the cows felt like Heidi going through, didn't we? Yeah. It's just gorgeous. Yeah. Amazing, magical moment again. Yeah, I also like the music from that one as well. It's really kind of uplifting yeah. and inspiring. It's crazy because it's so barren. It is like being, I imagine, on the moon when we went up towards where the uh, capsule was. The, the refuge, yeah. The refuge, yeah. Bring it up to date with 2020. What is your favourite video <laughs> from 2020? Okay, well, obviously we've had a lot of lockdowns and we're currently actually in tier three at the moment, so we're still not travelling very much. And we decided, because we've been cooped up for so long after the first lockdown, to go to Germany literally two days before um, we just decided, yeah, let's get on the Eurotunnel and head to Germany. Uh, the original plan was meant to be that we went on the Eurotunnel, went to Germany for so many days, and then we were going to head to Italy and have a wander up going around Italy and then come back through Germany. But because of COVID and all the restrictions, um, we ended up, we didn't want to self-isolate, so we ended up staying in Germany and it was the best thing. It was like a blessing in disguise, to be honest, because we just went around all the Bavarian Alps and we saw some amazing sights, didn't we? Yeah. My favourite has to be dangerous conditions and helicopter rescues. goodness I felt as I'm sure you did because I hadn't seen what Andy had had to face on that mountain I heard all about it but to actually see the footage back it was so scary 
um, but it had an amazing happy ending. It was fantastic. And see the helicopter. And I remember when I was walking, I could hear the helicopter and my thoughts were just like, oh my goodness, I hope this isn't Andy. Oh my goodness, I hope that's not him going in that helicopter. It was really scary, wasn't it? And I yeah. think that came across so well in the video as well. It was so true to life. It was, it happened and it was amazing. So it was great to take you as a viewer on that journey with us as well. So, um, and I know we had some really good comments, so obviously, hopefully mm. you enjoyed it too. <laughs> yeah. Well, that, that is actually kind of my favourite from 2020 as well, because I went through so many emotions on that. Yeah. And uh, I knew that I needed to kind of recreate that video in a way that uh, put that emotion and drama across. And I kind of think I did that with the, with the music. Hopefully I did. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. And uh, yeah, I was proper scared at some points on, on there. Did you just say scared? I know. I've never heard that come out of your vocabulary. It's, it's the first time. <laughs> Welcome to my world. <laughs> <laughs> what is this kit then? Are you going to show what else oh, you've been using? Oh, sorry, I forgot to say. Well, let's go back to 2018. No, 2019, <laughs> I, was, uh, I upgraded to a GoPro Hero 7. Much better than the, uh, the Session because it's got great stabilisation. Much better quality video in better sound so really good buy that was uh, but then in 2020 meet the poll <laughs> the poll oh, is, yes the poll has as many questions as uh, us I think uh, it's basically I use this in, in scenarios where I can't get uh, the drone footage which is quite a lot of the time but it extends oh, very gosh. very long the amount of comments I've had, that's why on quite a lot of videos, oh my God, you just hit me on the head. Quite a lot of videos now, you probably notice I'm quite far ahead. That is because Andy's got this monstrosity out and he just, just doesn't pay any attention to anybody. The amount of people that have come up to me and said, has he got his fish? Is that a fishing rod he's got? It's just ridiculously yeah, long. I can't even get it all in shot. Let's, uh, let's go. Uh, it's... You're not allowed to play with my pole. <laughs> I think that's the first time I've ever held it. God, it's huge. <laughs> On the end of this is a, a GoPro Max 360. Uh, and the magic in this is that it can actually hide the pole. Because it's got two lenses, one lens either side. And they sh overshoot just over 180. So this lens here is kind of shooting down this side. And this lens here is shooting all the way around onto this side. So when it interlaces the pictures together, the pole disappears, which is absolutely kind of fantastic for doing kind of vlogs and walking along and pretending someone else is actually doing the filming. Giving all insider knowledge now, yeah. aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> so there's only one thing left to do, and that is to celebrate. Absolutely. Somebody's been on the, uh, the Prosecco already. <laughs> oh well. Oh, I've got a bigger glass. Well, I, I prefer a beer anyway, so that's fine. So, anyway. It's, oh. You're not holding it at the bottom. Hey! <laughs> Cheers! Cheers, everyone, and Merry Christmas, and let's hope we have an amazing 2021. Yeah. Thank you! Bye! Bye! Bye.